Hi, it's Pamela. In this tutorial, we're going to go over how Doodly works. Hey, and welcome to the official Doodly YouTube channel. If you enjoy our content, please click the like and subscribe button below. Now let's get straight to the video. So what is Doodly exactly? Doodly is a whiteboard animation video creator, and it's very easy to use. While you can jump right in and start making your own whiteboard videos within minutes of purchasing and downloading it, it's helpful to understand how it works. So let's take a peek under the hood. Since Doodly simulates whiteboard drawings, it has several backgrounds that you can use. A whiteboard and glassboard, two chalkboards, custom colors, and even custom backgrounds if desired. As well as different hands holding markers, pens, and chalk to choose from. These elements form the bottom and top layers of your video. In between, you have characters and props, which are drawn onto the board by the hand. Now, it doesn't really draw the images because these images already exist. What it does is it simulates drawings by slowly revealing each pen stroke one at a time. Doodly works by using drawing paths on the image. So think of each drawing path as a pen stroke. Each path has specific points on it telling Doodly where to start and end each stroke. In Doodly, these drawing paths are also called reveal paths. And that's because Doodly doesn't really draw the image, rather it reveals the image one path at a time. If you've ever used a real whiteboard, then you know it's common to draw various elements, talk about them, and then erase them before moving on to the next topic. Doodly allows you to do the same with various scenes. Instead of drawing the images, you actually drag and drop them onto the whiteboard, and then you'll let Doodly reveal them when you're talking about them using a voiceover. From there, you can move on to a new scene by using a transition, such as an erase or a swipe, and that will get you to a clean whiteboard where you can repeat the process. Your whiteboard video can have as many scenes as you'd like. Doodly includes a library of characters, props, royalty-free music, sound effects, and fonts so you can easily create your own whiteboard videos. If you want to bring in your own graphics, audio tracks, or fonts, you can do that too. It has an import feature that's super easy to use and gives you a great amount of flexibility to make whiteboard videos with your own custom appearance. Perhaps one of the best ways to understand how Doodly works is to see it, okay? So I'm going to take this arrow. This is an arrow that I had imported earlier. It does not have any drawing paths assigned to it yet. If I right click it here and click preview, you'll see that it just kind of scribbles on by default. And while that's great in a pinch, it doesn't look realistic. Nobody scribbles an arrow on like that. Instead, they might start and do this, something like that. Or maybe they start at the point of the arrow and do this and that, and then add the squiggly lines. So you want to kind of think about how it would be drawn, and then you're going to tell Doodly how to do that. I'm going to click the arrow and then this edit icon. If you look in the live preview, you see the scribble effect here. So now what I want to do is I want to tell Doodly the path to draw this arrow on. So I'm going to go here and click on my path number one. And I'm going to tell Doodly where to start drawing. I want it to start at this point here. And it's a pen stroke. It's what we're thinking of it like, right? So maybe he goes, the pen starts here and ends here before it lifts up and then comes over here. So that's what I've told it. Start here, end here. You see this little red line? That's the path itself. And it's a little too narrow for this image. So I'm going to make it a little wider by adjusting the path size. Now let's add the next path. Click New Path. Tell it where to start and where to end. I'm going to click a new path. Now I'm going to go back to this one. And we're going to start here, and then we're just going to follow this curve with all these different little points. This is telling Doodly 
how to draw this line. Now Doodly knows, oh, it's a curved line. And then I can adjust the points as needed. So what you want is this red to cover the entire portion of black. Okay, now I'm ready for a new path. So I'm gonna click that and I'm gonna go down here and do the same thing. I'm gonna tell Doodly, follow this. And you'll notice in that live preview that it's now drawing on according to the instructions I just gave it. So I'm gonna go ahead and click Save and Return and we'll preview it. And now Doodly knows how to draw it. If that felt a little fast to you, you can change its duration. So now instead of being three seconds, it's five and a half seconds. And he draws it a little slower. I hope this gave you a better understanding of how Doodly works. Thanks for watching.